I'm Lester Smith. I've been at Abbey Road since January 1970. I can't say I've loved every minute, but um, it, it seemed to get better and better the longer I was here. I came here initially looking after the cutting lathes, cutting our vinyl discs. And as that was our sort of major output, record the music and then it's got to end up on a disc for the record factory and the sales of records kept the Abbey Road studios alive. And actually still doing that because vinyl records have come back again and we've got four cutting rooms. So again, that's still my job today. But after a couple of years, 1972, they wanted, they, the management asked for some technical chap to look after the microphones because that had been done on an ad hoc basis before. In other words, any engineer would have a go at fixing a microphone. So there were all sorts of results and um, failures and it was decided let's have one chap to concentrate on the microphones. So 1972, I went through all the microphones we had at that time, which was about 500, and I got an idea of how they all worked because I had no one to teach me and uh, had a few diagrams, circuit diagrams, and noted down voltages. And I've also got a unique way of testing microphones. I have a white noise little amplifier that sends a signal at a certain distance away um, in level with the diaphragm. And I measure the output on our, my meter. And that gives me what that particular mic does and in fact every mic of that type should give the same result so that becomes my standard and i've also got a soundproof box in my office which i can put the microphone in close up very tightly and all i hear then is the noise of a valve or the noise of a transistor or a FET and that will tell me if it's out of spec or not I change the valve, I put a new FET in, but sometimes it can be a capacitor or a resistor has gone noisy, but the valves are the sort of biggest, not problem, but the, the most likely item to go. And our microphone, our vintage microphone stock is something like over a hundred items.